Hello boys and girls, it's Coach Mary here, your swimming teacher. Um, I hope everybody is doing okay. Since we can't be doing swimming at the moment, um, we will be doing some landro exercises for you to develop your muscles and your strokes even without being in the water. Okay, so let's start. Okay, so to start our exercise, we will first be doing dynamic warm-up. The dynamic warm-up will help your muscles become more flexible and it will help you improve your stroke as well when you're in swimming. So the first warm-up we will be doing will be the side raise circle rotation. Okay, so we start with our hands at the sides and it goes all the way up to shoulder level. Now we do this in a circular motion, okay? 10 seconds every position. So we do front first and then we do 10 seconds reverse. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, back, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Next is arm claps. So from here, palms facing up. Okay. Up. Three. Ten seconds. Okay. So the next one is bent over lateral swing. So you bend over. Okay. Back straight. Okay. Feet a little bit apart. Okay. And start with your hands in front of you. Wide open all the way to your shoulders then back for 10 seconds Seven, eight, nine, ten. okay so the next one that we will be doing will be a little bit similar to butterfly and it's called the bent over straight arm pull we start by bending forward hands in front and you pull down just like when you're doing butterfly, okay? All the way to your hip. Two, three, for 10 seconds, okay? If you want to do another option, you can use a stretch cord. Eight, nine, ten, okay? Okay, so the next one that we will be doing will be the one arm raise with shoulder rotation. It is similar to backstroke, only that you will be doing your arm, uh, arm raise halfway. Rotate, then back down. Up, rotate, arm back down. For 10 seconds, and then you also do it with your other arm. Okay, back, down. For 10 seconds. Now, the remaining, um, exercises that we will be doing um, aims to develop your front crawl and the flexibility of your shoulder. One arm pull with shoulder rotation. So it's similar to the front crawl, only a halfway stroke and hip rotation. Arm straight, okay, all the way to your hip, there, then back, okay, for 10 seconds. And then also your other arm. One arm pull with elbow kickback. Now it's similar to the, the previous one that we did, only with your elbows going higher. So go all the way back, elbow high up. Then back. Other arm. Okay? And it goes back. One, all the way for 10 seconds, okay? Now your other arm. The one arm pull with shoulder touch, okay? So it's like a gradual position of your front row. Now go back. Here. Now the other arm. Pull. Touch the other part. Other 
right? So the last stretching that we will be doing is the one arm pull overhead. Same position, pull all the way back, up, up, your arm above your head, your palm facing down, in, then back, then your other arm, pull, over the head, and back. 10 seconds, each arm, okay? So now we start with our exercises. This exercise will be lunges to side arms. Okay. Lunges and side arms. Okay. Going back. Now the next one we will be doing will be the superman, okay? So you lie flat on your tummy and you raise both your arms and your legs and in a straight position, okay? Right there. Now you raise both arms and legs every time. Three, one, two, three, four. The next one will be the flutter kick. Okay, so this exercise aims to develop your core, so you need to bend our back a little bit up. Okay, hands up. Don't forget your straight pointy toes. Okay. Hold this for 10 seconds. Do this for 10 seconds, sorry. Squat jumps using streamlined position. Feet a little bit apart. Okay. Streamline position. Right. So that's it for today, boys and girls. I hope you'll stay fit at home and you can even let your parents join our exercises. Okay. I hope to see you again soon in school fit and healthy. Okay? See you!